Hi guys, and welcome to a review of the M Audio Keystation Mini 32. It's a 32 key portable MIDI controller keyboard. So, what are the advantages of the Keystation Mini 32? Well, for starters, it's very light and very small. That means that it will fit in your backpack and won't weigh it down, whether you're travelling around uni or even on the bus or train. It also features a volume control, sustain, modulation, and octave buttons all on the keyboard. And these can be assigned to anything because it's a MIDI controller as well as a keyboard. It's also very easy to plug and play and features a miniature USB to USB cable that comes in the box. It's also quite cheap. I managed to pick this up for around £37, which is not too bad. So what are the cons? Well, for a start the keys are not weighted or semi-weighted and they have very little travel. To add to this, the keys aren't even full size and there's only 32 of them. So I think this wouldn't be sufficient for a true pianist. However, if you're just putting in one note lines, I think it would be. Another thing to mention is the velocity sensitivity. At times this can be quite poor, maybe due to the little travel of the keys. An example of this is when you're really trying to get some expression and emotion across when you're playing. However, it's not very good at translating that and you may find yourself going into the DAW at a later date and changing the velocities yourself. Overall, I feel this is a great little keyboard. It has lots of functionality, it's plug and play, it's very light and it's also fairly cheap as well. I'd recommend this to anybody who's travelling around with it in their backpack um, and it's a great accompaniment to a laptop for instance to help somebody be more creative on the road. Thanks for watching guys, I hope this has helped you make your own mind up about the M Audio Keystation Mini 32. If you want to see more videos like this, I'm hoping to be uploading a video every week. However, although I'm quite new to this, I'd appreciate it if any constructive criticism comments. Thanks guys.